So PlayStation is going to start 2021 with a bang. They have three big games for PSN Plus. Every Tuesday, the first Tuesday of every month, we get three new games. And this month, it's a pretty good selection. The first one is a PS5 exclusive PSN Plus game. You can download this on the 5th of January for free. It's currently out right now. Uh, so it's got ray tracing, 4K, 60 FPS. That's the PS5 version. Haptic feedback with the DualSense controller. And you take the role of a small baby shark. As it evolves into a mega shark. You can kill humans, whales, fishies, turtles. It is a shark RPG. It's actually a lot of fun. I enjoyed it a lot. I've done a whole series of the game on my channel. If you guys want to check it out for yourself. Civ is worth downloading. I know you guys have data caps and stuff like that. But the PS5 version has 60 FPS, 4K, haptic feedback, ray tracing, all that sort of juicy stuff. It's a, it's a good version. And it only released, I believe, in November. So it's pretty brand new. Next up is Shadow of the Tomb Raider. This released in 2018, the latest Tomb Raider title. It is a direct sequel to Rise of the Tomb Raider. It is a PS4 game, but you can play it via backwards compatibility. Stealth is much more important in this game. Line of sight, you can camouflage with mud. Bleed out, I believe, as well. You can rappel down. Uh, they made adjustments to the gameplay in terms of swimming. It's been revised. You can breathe for longer underwater, for longer periods of time due to air pockets. Um, it's generally a sequel to the first two games and it got received pretty well IGN gave it a 9 out of 10 and uh, yeah definitely worth checking out I never got around to playing it so I'm gonna go back and probably play it this month at some point the the new Tomb Raider titles I just never got around to playing much I don't know how that happened they're, they're very very good games anyway we move on the last one is called Greedful so this is actually an RPG which I I done one part on and I regret stopping it so much because it was a really really good game and now it's free for PSN Plus users, again on PS4, but you can play it through backwards compatibility on the PS5. These are three incredible, incredible games. Very, 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 very good selection. So it's a typical RPG, lots of customization, a bit of supernatural in there as well. There's definitely a lot of human conflict, but there is a definitely a strong supernatural, massive monster vibe in it as well. And it is a really, really cool game. I regret not playing it more. Um, I really enjoyed the first little couple of hours. I will have links to the games in the description below if you guys want to check out videos on those games. I particularly recommend checking out Man Eater if you have a PS5. It is addictive. Very, very fun. Very, very fun indeed. Give it a good hour or so. It's probably not for everyone, but I really like the, the sort of feeling of starting as a baby shark and evolving into a mega shark. There's lots of customization options as well. There's nothing like trying to jump out of the water and kill a human on a lilo. <laughs> It's the best feeling. We all know how good the Tomb Raider games are. And obviously this is the latest Tomb Raider game. And the fact you can play on PS5. I love that. Greedfall is definitely an underrated RPG game. We don't get many RPG games anymore. And this is definitely one to check out. And the fact you can play it for free with PSN Plus is a massive plus. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Should do more of these in the future. Should do sim something similar for Xbox as well. Uh, just letting you guys know what's coming out on PSN Plus. I'm guessing a lot of you guys have Plus on your P on your PlayStation consoles. So this is just a reminder to go and check the store, to, no to download these games, redeem those games. As long as you have PSN Plus, these games will continually be free on your system. So really, really cool. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and bye-bye.